What's going on? It's Fist bringing you another raw edition straight from my heart for me to you because that's what I do. Some Modern Warfare 2, F2000, FN2000 for you picky people. I don't give a shit. Whatever, it's F2000. Beautiful gameplay when things are simpler. Now going on to my last video from the original Fist channel, I told you I was going to get deep into it. And it seems to me, we have a lot of people that are off track. For some odd reason, we got Respawn Entertainment making Mech Warrior, whatever, first person shooter, spaceship Mech Warrior, Bungie making Destiny spaceship ripoff Halo. Listen, this Space Warrior shit is dead as fuck. It's dead. And I'm going to make a prediction right now. I'm going to go ahead and say that uh, Respawn Entertainment's game, based on West leaving that uh, franchise, and the fact that uh, Respawn Entertainment is under the publishing umbrella of Electronic Arts, which is in direct contact to Battlefield and the DICE Studio, that Respawn Entertainment is not going to be making any modern combat game. And furthermore, we live in a society where we like to kill each other constantly. Constantly. My, we, Our country has been at war forever. Forever. And that's why we can relate to it. We can relate to modern shooters. We can relate to modern military shooters and that's space odyssey 2000 the only thing that space related the only thing that respawn should have took should have stole from they stole from the wrong franchise you know with battlefield or battlefront being taken out instead of stealing from a shitty franchise like mech warriors or NS2 or Killzone 2 or any of those and I'm sure maybe it is not going to be on the new 720 Xbox whatever and it's going to have a new engine and maybe and maybe their interpretation of that gameplay is going to fit your your you know the new shooters and in uh Space Odyssey first person shooters maybe that's a bunch of fucking maybes that's a bunch of fucking maybes. Maybe go back to square one where the premise of Call of Duty actually works. Like maybe go back to a wooden fucking wheel, a stone wheel, then a wooden wheel, then a t wheel with a fucking air in it and an inner tube. Maybe that works. The only thing that's going to work, and it seems to me that a bunch of developers have pussy syndrome. Like, they cannot, they don't have or are willing to, you know, take on the challenge of making Call of Duty a better game. The premise of the game is great. Look at Modern Warfare 2. Look at this game. Take out explosives. Take out some of the other bullshit and maybe tone down the snipers. Put a new engine on the philosophy of this game. It's a mega hit. I don't understand why it's always a problem and maybe we got uh, developers that are divas that just you know want to keep making games that fail maybe I understand that you know Weston's and Pella didn't have an opportunity to make their fucking frontline fuel a war or whatever it is their fucking game that the publisher says is not gonna make it it's not gonna make it I mean, these are games that, the you know, when DICE split up and half of them went to chaos and wherever the fuck else they went to make Frontline's Fuel War and other fucking games that failed, it didn't work. So when you split off and you want to go make Mech Warrior Spaceship fucking first person shooter, it's not going to work. You know, you had a fucking hit. You had the wheel. Here's what you do. You take what you have. And you take the same philosophy that Mortal Kombat and Ed Boon used, and you look back at the situation. 
What did they do? Mortal Kombat tried the same fucking thing. They tried uh, run button, block button, third, 3D, 4D, all that shit failed. They finally got to the point where they took 3D backgrounds, you know, you can use them, they look beautiful, a nice new engine, and, and mechanics of the game. The premise was already there. That was already established. You should have used what was already there. You know, I think the only hope for anybody here is this. Here's the only here is the only hope that you have. And this is the this is the hope. The hope is this. You better hope that Homefront 2 by Crytek is going to be a good game. That's my opinion. You know, I doubt it because Crytek is under the EA publishing window. You know what I'm saying? So that's my, you know, I don't know why they wouldn't go on to, you know, take advantage of this situation and do this. Why don't you take Call of Duty, jack their idea, and make it better? I don't know what any developer out there is waiting for. What are you waiting for? What is the problem? That's the main problem. You know, I don't understand it. I don't know what they're waiting for. You know, it all it takes is one developer. It doesn't matter left, right, whatever. Take what you have already. I see NASA make a video be like, yo, ha be happy with what you have. Be happy with the views you have. Be happy with the money you have. Be happy with the life you have. Be happy that your fucking engine was a hit right out the bat. What do you think somebody who plays a fucking lottery and wins the lotto and makes $200 million is going to just keep playing the lotto and it's just not a fucking enough for them? You've already won, man. You've already fucking hit the jackpot. I don't know how much more I can stress this point. I really don't know how much more clear can i make it how much more clear can i make it if you know activision has the right idea they understand that this is a great game the bad thing is is they have the wrong studios with the wrong ideas the the worst ideas in this game literally somebody could take the call of duty franchise from them and make it better it seems to me the developers don't want to do that. I've talked to some, and it's surprising to me the responses that I get. What, do you want to make another Call of Duty clone? Well, yeah, fuck yeah, it works. Why wouldn't you? Instead, they go and fucking jump off the deep end and want to be cool and ultra fucking whatever it is. You know, I'm a developer. I'm going to make my own. I'm going to be Notch and shit. No, fucking Notch is the type of guy that comes around once in a million years. You understand? Those type of guys, it's not every day somebody comes out with great. No, come out with the idea and do better what the, do better. I I mean, look at Battlefield is so fucking hard-headed and Activision, they can't even figure it out. And they spend billions and millions. I mean, if you look at between Microsoft and uh, uh, EA, they're fucking, I don't get it. I'm fucking, I don't get it. And to be frankly honest with you, I don't think anybody else gets it either. You know, we in the community, the majority, or what is it? You know, I'm not a, I'm not, I am not a pro player, and I am not a shitty player. I am the guy that's in the middle. The fucking means. You know what the means is? That means I represent the majority. That's what the fucking means is. And when you represent the majority, that means everybody that is in the means likes the game buys the game and spends their fucking money and plays the game what is the problem there anyways i hope you enjoyed this awesome fucking gameplay get the fuck out of here